Welcome to our demonstration on how to create a virtual machine backup job. In this demonstration, you'll see how easy and intuitive it is for the vSphere administrator to create backup jobs with vSphere data protection. From the Getting Started tab, select Create Backup Job. In the Create a New Backup Job wizard, you have the option to create a full image backup or select individual disks for backup. For this backup job, we select individual disks and click Next. Now choose the virtual machine disks you would like to back up. In this case, we select Hard Disk 2 from our Linux virtual machine. Now let's define a schedule for the backup job. A backup job can be scheduled to run once per day, once per week, or once per month. This backup job will run daily at 11 p.m. By default, the retention policy is set to 60 days. As you can see, there are multiple options for defining a retention policy. For this backup job, we will keep the default setting. Provide a name for this backup job, Linux VMs, and click Next, and then Finish. A notification window pops up. Click OK. Your backup job has now been created. To view and manage backup jobs, select the Backup tab. If you want to see which virtual machines are protected by the backup job, click on the Show Items in the Backup Job detail section. Here, you can see that Hard Disk 2 of the Linux Virtual Machine is protected by this backup job. There are several options available for managing the backup job. Edit allows you to modify the job. You can clone or delete a backup job. It is also possible to disable a backup job to prevent it from running at its scheduled time. A disabled job can then be enabled when needed. In addition to the backup job running at its scheduled time, it is also possible to manually start a backup job. Click Backup Now, which presents two options. We choose Backup All Sources and click OK. Now that the backup job has run, you can see information such as the last start time, the duration of the job, and the next time it is scheduled to run. You can also see that the job was successful. This concludes our demonstration on creating a virtual machine backup job with VMware vSphere Data Protection. Thank you.